Almost everyone missed the Easter egg in God of War Ragnarok. After you finish the game and go on to 100% of it, you find out that the real Tyr is alive and imprisoned. Once he's free, you'll spot him across various locations in six different realms, doing what may seem like random actions at first, but they are much more. The director of the game confirmed that animations are, in fact, an Easter egg. In Helheim, he is making a circular gesture. In Muspelheim, he's sitting cross-legged. In Alfheim, he's standing with one arm horizontal. In Svartalfheim, he's sitting on on his uncrossed knees, arms resting in his lap, in Vanaheim he's making waves, and in Midgard he's just standing. Some said these were yoga poses, and the next game would be set in Hindu mythology. Others believe that the sun poses were similar to Tai Chi of Chinese mythology. The most accurate assumption is that the sun pose is meant for the sun god Ra, and the southward facing is a white crane pose meant for the Egyptian god Thoth. Crazily, in the God of War comics, Kratos actually meets a white crane and Thoth himself.